eggs. I'll remember that. This might be the one time these people are right. <laughs> the end is now. Are you still ignoring his warnings? Did you feel the snow? Witness the eclipse? Seeing the dying animals? The signs are upon you. Arcadia Bay is the final battleground for Pazuzu. Isaiah... I don't care. Alright. Photos. Interesting. Oh. Oh. Looks like a message. David, this is Officer Corn. Just want to let you know your stepdaughter's car was identified near the Blackwell campus last night, around the time of the break in. What? Give me a call soon. Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? Hmm. <laughs> Maybe Joyce should know about this. I mean, why should she, huh? Erase. Message deleted. Goodbye, message. I think Chloe she probably heard that. Break from all this bullshit. She did probably hear that though. Wowza. Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. Although apparently she doesn't care. Joyce looks so different in her street clothes. Okay, Joyce, before we go talk to your bitch ass, let's just look around. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Refrigerators are pretty heavy to move, I mean so I they keep probably would. Expecting to see the sky turn red. Is it that ominous now? No, we'll look at that later. Mm, sliding door. Can't go in here. Sliding door. Yeah, you slide that door, Max. Show your power. Alright. Where the fuck are we? We're in the backyard. I th I went out here before, right? I hope so. Oh, look at all these dead birds. Oh, dead bird. Poor thing. Looking ominous. I wonder how these birds died. Three dead oh birds my god. Up? It's a symbol. That's fucking ominous. Remember that Illuminati sign? Well, like, if you took two of these birds from e each end and just push them down more on like a f through a 45 degree angle direction whatever uh it would make a triangle and illuminati symbol is like a triangle so there you go match okay i figured it out sitting in a swing always feels so comforting I remember when Chloe and me would take turns in the swing. We would push each other so hard we'd fly way up in the air. Chloe always wanted to swing all the way around. I always got scared and would jump off before I flew off. And Chloe is still trying to get high. All right. Sorry about that. Just munching on some poppy corn. All right. So what do we do in here? We can close it if we want, but why would we? Maybe we can have like a, a rapist sneak in and kill us. All right. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh. I mean, Max. I see, told you. Oh, you startled me. Who got it? Well, you fit those Who got well. it? Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Pancakes. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. The meal of uh, a badass. I more than William. And he loved them. <laughs> I remember. 
We would erase each other to grab the from the stack. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. I need no. you to grab me the eggs and milk. Fuck you. You make for me. Eggs and milk? No problem. I boss. I boss. Bossy boss boss. I remembered the eggs. Haha. -ha. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Does she still say it, or did her opinion change? There's the milk. Now for the mother's milk. Aha, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. A lot of people don't realize where the eggs are, because it, it is kind of placed rather oddly over here, but... You know, if you pay attention, explore... Like my awesome ass, then you'll know. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I doubt would love it. to think that too, Joyce. But we are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. All right. I hate to even think this, much less say it out loud, but I think Rachel is in serious trouble. I know. I watch those awful true crime shows, and it makes me ill if I think about Rachel ending up on one. So I don't hmm. think too much. I see hmm. why Chloe is so obsessed with finding her. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Mm, yeah. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Because Got I'm a it. badass. Um, did she really? I'm a fucking... Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what? A century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, you. If only I could go back. Yeah, badass youth. That, I'm Joyce. a wrecking machine, you whore. Voila, a breakfast bit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> Fuck him. The table. Fuck you too. Screw both of you. I'm taking over. I'm the king of this table. Now. This is the kingly seat. This is the new king seat. Don't care what anyone says. I, because I'm the king, I get to decide. I get to dictate what is the king seat. I guess nobody waters the plant here. You need to have everything Thank on tip-top so shape. Choice. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. No, I'm not cleaning. Fuck you. No, that's what I call pancakes. You can't snake. You can't sneak me in like that, like a snake oil salesman. Don't even try it. Yummy. Didn't look like it really took much. Oh, wow. <laughs> we did not look like we ate that much, but... Looked like we took like little niblets on our fork. <laughs> Alright, peanut butter. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Why would it be oh, crunchy? Man. I don't want to be famous for this. Flash no and freak apoc uh, eclipse. Apocalypse soon? Um... We're not necessarily causing that. Or are you saying you don't want to be famous for that? I mean, you know. Seeing you again. Oh. Ah, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. You got that right. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Cool style. Yeah. Hashtag awesome. cool style. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. Yeah. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, so instant. It was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this. And, and 
and it ate him. I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, morbid. I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, light. positive, and everything she's not today. This was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. I wonder why. Did you guys oh. have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always yeah. about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Feed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're Hey, don't tell me what to do. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Oh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. Going, Chloe. I have to Let's use do this. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now, who's being Keep paranoid? it going. Just listen to yourself. Nobody else Yo does. Yourself. Yourself. Listen to yourself. I do need to get into David's computer. He's got to be hiding shit. Definitely I bet is. David has all of his surveillance secrets in his laptop. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. Yeah, I don't I think, think that's gonna work. <laughs> uh, I don't think he's self aware, Max. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. I don't think he cares that much about that. Oh, yeah, we're gonna be hearing that a lot now, by the way. Nothing to see here. Maybe it's Cheez Its. No? Okay. Book. The Holy Looks Bible. Like David has read this oh. a lot. What did he learn? Probably not much. Oh my god, it's David! He is the father. Oh, we already know this. For the password. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Good thinking. Could it really be anything. You're just just coming full sorts of ideas, aren't you, Max? There's no way Chloe can put that gun. Every number you see, you're like, it's that. Well, what do you know? If she has a gun, she could shoot it open. Padlock. Naturally, David would buy a heavy-duty military padlock. He's not I can't using even it. see the combination. It Ooh. might be a useful password. I'll keep that in mind. Seven one seven one. The cupboard. Nothing can in see. it. Can we see it? Oh, we can't see that shit again. All right. That's fine. No, oh, okay, that's fine. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. It's a long time. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. You God, everything's a good password, can't Max. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Honk, just married. Yeah, I guess you can't. But you know, it's a knife. He wants to kill them. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. Keep your wings up. This guy delusional. Does he think he's an angel now? Alright, why doesn't Chloe put her truck in... Ah, uh, whatever. I guess... Doesn't want to be associated with this douchebag. Now the car, car. Looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Check the shit Joyce out. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. It was an honor. It was an honor having you in the diner. Nice to know that gentlemen still exist. Love to talk again with you soon. By the way, the name is Joyce, if you forgot. Happy face. It might be a useful password. Oh my god. This is when they met. Oh my god. Could this be the password? Two whales diner. Receipt. Eggs and sausage. God damn, it's a lot for just that. Bullshit. Come see us again. Oh ho ho! How witty. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, a bag. That's cute. Could be a password here. 
Hmm. What was that again? Sorry. That's cute. Could be Success a password here. Here. company to a real life hero. All right. Well, in keeping with in keeping with spirits, in keeping in spirits or whatever with um, what happened before when we fucking forgot about that evidence, we may as well I fucking reveal. The oh, to David's computer. never mind. I was gonna basically just send him a message by keeping that door open, and then he'd be like, "Oh my God, someone went in here." All right. So, whoops. So I already know what it is. It's this. <laughs> Score. Max the hacker strikes again. Whoa. Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely Everyone. hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Everyone, uh, tune out of this video if you have not caught up to this point yet, because spoiler alert here, as she said. A lot of spoilers. Uh, for information, meet once again. Rachel's been cutting class all week. Rachel avoids her dormitory. Followed Rachel to the lighthouse. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. KM follows the same path to every class. Well, I mean, well, why not? I generally followed, like, the same path to my classes. I mean, whatever's most convenient. Alright. Uh, overheard Kate and Dana talking about supplies for Vortex Club Party. Drugs? Watch Kate with her church group. She knows her babble. Kate stays in bathroom longer than other students. Drugs? Saw Kate helping Jefferson after class. Don't trust go <laughs> grown men with goatees. Kate is kept to herself since Vortex Club party. Not even church. Drugs? Talked to Kate about the party. She got upset and ran. Guilty. Oh, this guy. This, this is guy. so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Oh, wow. I, call, I actually call myself Mad Max. That's cool. Max Factor, Noir Angel. <laughs> uh, all right, nice one. I better tell Chloe about this now. Uh, it's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. Let's get the fuck out of here. All right. Oh my God. What now? I'd love to style you up if you want. If I do go, I'd love to get a tailor makeover. Talk soon. Okay, I, I befriended her before, and I... Oh, well, I'll just keep my mouth shut for now. Alright, bitch, we got what you wanted. Oh, this shit did. Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. Oh, poor you. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure? If nah, we didn't really take it over is? yet. Who else would do? But it? we will. You see. Gonna bust them. And <laughs> good luck. Good luck with that. <sighs> Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber? Why How does everyone keep saying that? You know Fuck. Than me. No. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras, so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Oh, boy. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Ooh, Chloe. Snap. He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Right, so this has always been really obvious for me. <laughs> you're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. 
Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Uh oh. You're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. <laughs> well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm outflanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Eh, it's fine. I don't want to see or hear you again, Max. You've hurt me and my family well. enough. Well, fine, as long as you stay the fuck out of my way, you won't, bitch. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? Noted. Let's get the fuck out Max, of here. Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Oh, don't worry about that. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being... More than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Oh Frank boy. Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? There's no way Motherfuck this could go wrong. Better not have anything for his sake. Oh, he's actually there. Too. Let's check the door. Cool. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not Brute anymore. fest. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shitballs. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract balls. Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Good thinking, Chloe. Sorry. I got this. I'll be right back. Yeah. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a smoothie snack to distract his mangy mutt. Good thinking. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Good minion thinking, Chloe. How is this? Ugh, gross. Mm, there's no, there's no like you're actually reaching anything, and if you, whenever you are, it's like your your hands are going completely through it, like transdimensionally. <sighs> I hope she finds a nice T-bone to keep the doggy busy. Oh, police. God, the police are always here. What the fuck? Did they actually do anything? <laughs> uh. Alright. Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses, now dying animals? Holy shit. What is going on here? A lot. This is so creepy. Did you see that? It was like a slide there. Like moonwalk slide. <laughs> Alright. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Maxine, pop here. I'm sorry I haven't gotten blah 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 shit. Read that. Alright, your will. Oh. Let's... Do we have anything more, uh, here? Yeah, we do. Let's keep up with this. Was this where we left off? Oh, right. Left off here. So here. Here. And here. Boop. What the hell? Good there morning. Go. How are the fish today? It's like lagging. Don't huh? ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next? Don't Tornado? ask. Don't ask me, bitch. Uh. I hope not. Could be worse. We could get one of those California quakes. True. Well, I'm feeling a little dizzy now. Hope you catch the big one today. I better. Too late to switch careers now. See you around, kid. Yeah, see you around, buddy. Can't chat now. Gotta focus on the fish. Well, then go over there to focus on them. You're, what the fuck are you doing standing? Hey. Hey, do you know who I am? 
Do you know who I am? Do you... Oh, you're gonna fucking get it. You're gonna fucking... You son nope, of a bitch. I don't want to go there. Oh, Max. Why is everyone such an asshole? They just push me around like I'm nothing. Fuck you. I will get you for that. I remember your face. I remember all faces. I encounter. You'll learn that later. Deja vu. There's dust on the dust now. Jesus. Bye, uh... Oh my. Careful, Max. Cujo ahead. Locked. Okay, good. Right, right, it was locked. Okay, I don't know why I was thinking. I don't know what the hell I was thinking. Anyway. I was like, oh, is the game actually giving me an opportunity to do it now? <laughs> uh. That would be cool to be a trucker for a while. Always oh, this is a douchebag. Alright. Hey, I love going? shit up. Peachy. Interview over. Why does everyone think I'm interviewing them? I don't... Worst interview ever. Work is Got that right. up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money for a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could Time. drive right out of Arcadia Bay. Whole Time is money for everyone, shit, dude. Snow, eclipse, and a slut trying to commit suicide. Maybe you should leave then. What if I could? <laughs> and even that shifty Whoa. Rachel what's her face asked me once if I drive her to Los Angeles. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you oh, why is it? Oh. Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18 out there. <laughs> like I said, so cool. Over. Yeah, you and your awesome little truck there. I'll take a photo of it. Hey, no photo girl. Why'd your voice just change like that? What the fuck? Okay, why do I abide by him? I, I wish I could take it anyway, and then when he comes at me, I can take out a knife and stab him in the eye. Jesus. I'd love just... to do a whole big rig photo series. I'd love to fucking stab you in the balls, shit. Let's uh, see. Do they teach English over at that arty farty school? I'm done. Alright, go fuck yourself. It just kept up. I just realized, um. I don't know if this is a glitch, but depending on. I think depending on what you choose there at the beginning, it. The, the one I chose. The dialogue option I chose, it like skipped. A bunch of other choices I would have had there, and just follow a certain path. I think. Uh, they teach I remember. Over that arty farty school? I'm I remember the stuff that he said that uh, that he said was like responses directly to the choices I made. So I had this before too, but I don't know. Hey. Peachy. All right. Actually. I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 needed 18 this bullshit. How the hell did you know that? Because, uh, apparently I'm about as fucking sh shitty as you. Um. I'm sorry, that could have been way better. I, I don't. I can't think of insults now. Oh, God, what are we doing? Um. Rachel Amber, eh, yeah, let's just see. I took class. a Blackwell class on the history of truckers. Yeah, I just go to the history channel. To drive a rig on the road. Finally, a Blackwell student with brains. Next time I get a local job, I'll let you ride along. Take care. Well, I will happily decline because I do not want to ride along with you unless it involves killing you in the end. Hey, no photo girl. Wait. What? No, ew, what? what? Uh, do they teach English over at that art party school? I'm done talking. Over and out. Ah, uh, this shouldn't be happening. Hold on. Uh, okay, this is really awkward now. Hey. Peachy. Um. How that? Skip all that shit. Rachel Amber? My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel. Okay, maybe. She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers. Or real work. <laughs> so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those you know who know what's. 
non-truckers. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Thank uh, yeah, thank you for your permission, shithead. If it were my if it were my choice, I wouldn't fucking need it, but because I have to abide by Max's standards. And sometimes she's not as uh, hard minded as she probably should be. Because. I made the trucker happy, and I get to photograph this bitch in 1977. Yeah, I don't really want to make him happy, though. Four, Max. So, how about we do this? How about we cheat a little bit? How about we take the photo, and we have it, and now I can piss him off. And tell him to go fuck himself. How about that? Hey, Peachy. Hmm. Having a bad day at the office? Work is dried up around. That sucks. Maybe you should leave then. What if I? What the hell? You knew Rachel. I swear there used to be nope. dialogue options here. This is so fucked up. Oh, whatever. I, uh, I would, like, cuss him out for talking about Rachel Amber. I don't know why my game's glitched like that. I think that's what it is. Oh, God. That is so embarrassing. I'm gonna get trolled hard. For what? For sa for saving Kate? <laughs> oh, you saved a suicidal person. Fucking faggot. So ominous. It's like the Milky Way galaxy. Look at that. Do, 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 Look do, at that. Do. So sad and disturbing and beautiful at once. What an amazing shot. Wait a minute, did I just get an achievement for that? Uh, I'm not gonna bother checking, but I'm pretty sure I've taken this photo before. I don't know why. If I just got an achievement there. Whatever. I hate seeing old women on the street like that. <sighs> nice world. You do you not remember talking to her before? Hi. All right. How are you? I remember you, Max. I remember you too. Can I get you something from the diner? I heard about that girl almost jumping off the Blackwell roof. The Blackwell roof. Let's get straight to the point. I think it's all connected to Rachel Amber's disappearance. A lot of things in Arcadia Bay are connected to Rachel. Hmm. Including Nathan Prescott? That spoiled shit finally got kicked out of his daddy's school. He also drugged the girl who tried to jump. Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. Well, that wasn't I hard. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you'd like to tell me what you're hiding. Ooh, Snoopy. Nosy. Just like me. I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe. And you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. How do I'm you know? I'm just gonna say this. Maybe I'm schizophrenic. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed. See, that by sounds a very schizophrenic. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. That's true. Thanks for the warning. I kinda got some evidence to back me up. I don't know how much good it's gonna do you, but thanks for that storm warning, Max. And uh I'll let you know if I find out anything. I hope you do. I don't know what you could possibly find out unless you're like one of those Sherlock homeless. I hate seeing old women on the street like that. Ugh, nice world. Uh, I've already heard that, right, right, right. Looked at that. Oh, huh. Oh. Tornadoes, snowfall. Oh yeah, yeah, we, we heard that. Now dying let's get the fuck in here. Come on, let's go. Holy shit. Do do do. 